Hey, good morning. We're going to move on to March of the Machines box number two for me. Um, how many? Probably a couple set boxes for me too. Yeah. And then at that point, then we'll probably start some patron openings and so on and so forth. Then get, you know, some battles and some individual breaks going on. So let's get into this. this is number two for me. Interested to see what we're going to get. Not going to spend quite as much time as I did the first video. Now that I have a better layout of what we're looking at, it's still literally the release day. So, as far as piles and usually cards of value or not value or so on and so forth, still don't know exactly where everything is going to go. Hey, Invasion of Lorwyn, I didn't get that before. That's cool. Okay, planes. Okay, our caveats. So we got Strixhaven land. I'll, let's put the rares up there. That's fine. Rona. So that's the new Rona. And the Tolerian Obliterator. Still looks like Rona, though, in that picture, just with extra arms. Okay, we got the Exsanguinator Calvary. Interesting. Oh, and create a blood token. Okay. Then we got Time Rent. Don't care. Finn the Fang Bear. So that is in the pretty sweet foil treatment in the Halo foil. Uh, foil. I like the new artwork for Finn. Looks good. And then we got Bright Palm Soul Awakener Commander Mythic. And Fire Song and Sunspeaker. I seriously didn't realize they added that to this product, considering they just reprinted it. I don't mind reprints. Just, you know, did you have to do another one already? <laughs> was, that, was that needed? That's all right. We'll still put it there. <clears throat> yeah, was, was it? Was Fire Song and Sunspeaker? I mean, a lot of these weren't needed, so I should probably preface that not every card they chose can be a card that's worth money in a standard set if you want it to be hey Dejuru and Hazaret this card may end up being better than I think it is we got Deep Root Wayfinder Sirak and Gur uh, Gorklaw that's that's another cool team up dig that didn't pull any of those yet so sweet Rada Renata is that just in... Is that, is that etched? Yeah, it's etched, isn't it? It actually looks cool with the Constellation frames. Oh! Croxa uh, and Kuneros in the foil. Uh, almost borderless, but actually uh, Constellation. That, that actually looks pretty sweet. And Lutri. Good old Lutri. Band and Commander. Wasn't that thing banned, like, immediately, too? <clears throat> so we got Brawl and Kari Zev. Yeah, it's going to go on the bottom. City on Fire. Now, <clears throat> is this better than Fire Emancipation? There are many people out there like, yes, it is. There are others that are like, hell no. Cost more. In the end, it depends on the deck, doesn't it? Either way, that's still a sweet pull. I want to put that over there in like some kind of weird sweet pull. We got Dark Steel Splicer, Commander Card, Inga. Come on. Daxos, yeah, those uh those constellation borders look really good foil etched. Those look good. Nahiri Warcrafting. And Garuda. Dawn, uh, sorry, Doom of Depths. Eh. It's, it's two out of three have given me uh, companions. But that's, that's we're going to see a lot of that in this product. Just when, you, when you look at the breakdown, there's 30 rares, I think. Ten of them are, ten of them, ten out of 30 rares are companions. So we are going to see many of them. It's going to happen a lot. So get used to it, I guess. 
Rowan's Talents. So these are the commander cards that are not actually in the decks, but are only in the set and collectors, I believe. Okay, Drana and Linvala. Cool. Death Greeter's Champion. That's a cool name. It's got Dash. Okay, that's fun. Yuri. Dina in the... Ooh. That looks good. Dina in the uh, Halo Foil. Om nom 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 Nath Showcase. And Lathiel in the regular foil. You know what? Why did I put Dina there? <clears throat> Dina, you go there. Because you know you're an uncommon. That's really cool. You can go there. And you also go there. Perfect. So far, nothing spicy in this video. Well, I guess City and Fire kind of qualifies. Oh, we have something coming up. Oh, we've got multiple things coming up. Okay, we found the hit pack. Uh, this is my this is my third shield red in two boxes. <laughs> that time in the regular pack foil version. That's my fourth glistening dawn. <laughs> All right. I think glistening dawn's a neat card, but it's fine. It's fine. Whatever. Pain distributor. Yargle, Yuri, Infernal Sovereign, so a Commander Mythic, huh? Big old demon. Whenever you play a land or cast a spell, draw a card and lose a life. Wow. Uh, Zuri. Okay, that's the... Is that... that that's, um... <clears throat> That's the Commander deck of Zuri, right? Claw of Pogress. Recently had a reprint in Double Masters 2022. I saw the Ikor frame and I, and I kind of... I'll admit, I immediately am like, oh good, we have another... Uh... Wait, is, is Zuri a... Yeah, Zuri's a Mythic because it was also a Mythic in Double Masters 2022. But I was like, oh sweet, we got another... Um, sorry, Praetor already. Nah, you got a Zuri. Which is still a pretty good card, but still. Oh well, moving on. C double. Shieldred. <laughs> I, can't, I can't stop. I can't stop pulling shieldreds. <laughs> That's hilarious. Troop scriptures that time in the Ikor. Okay, Vivian's talent. So another talent card. Agar. Timeret. Voldarian Thrill Seeker. Season. Sizen. Whatever. The printing on that seems off, though, but whatever. Still cool. All right, moving on. So we got the Progenitor Eckhart. Eckhart. Eh, I can't even say it. Can't even say things right now. Eh, it doesn't even go up there. Hoarding Blue uh, Broodlord. Yeah, I truly can't talk right now. I'm freaking done. Okay, Emergent Wood Worm. Commander. Card. Riona. Sorry, Rona. God, I'm all over the place. Finn in the foil etched. Hey, Ozolith in the foil. Sweet. Foil extender art. Nice. And a mythic. Vor. Oh, that is cool. Vorinclex in the foil etched. That I dig. That's sweet, actually. That's that's really cool. All right, kind of want all of them in that treatment there. The Arc Priest of Shadows, Phoenix, Uncivil Unrest, Zada, yeah. Ray Evan foil. Is that yeah, it's just regular foil? It, only okay, so the picture itself and the actual none of that's foil. But then just the border, which is kind of neat. So that's it. They did a different treatment specifically on the Kaladesh inventions. And the Chrome Host Seed Shark. And Hirobi, Death Whale. 
Uh, no special. Okay. So we got four packs left. Have I been missing the Halo foils or am I just not really getting any of them? I mean, oh well. Is this who I think it is? It is not. It is a Tali, though. I didn't pull one of those yet, so that's sweet. Oh. Uh, either way. Primal Sickness. Um, you know, it, it's not meant to be a chase for these, right? So, but the fact that it doesn't have, like, the actual kind of gold and, the, frankly, these borders aren't popping at all. That's super dumb. I hate to call it that, but this is super dumb. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan. Even besides the whole writing thing, and they did that so you can actually play with the card. I, I get that. Herald of Hoofbeats. That's cool. Other knights you control have horsemanship. Love it. Rayev times two. That one looks a little different, doesn't it? Yeah, okay, so this is some kind of halo foil that didn't quite work because when you don't foil the rest of this. Yeah, because you can even feel it on there. So it's a different, okay, so that's a halo foil one. This is a regular foil one. Ah, that's impossible to tell. Fears it. And a Vorn. All I pull are Vorn Glacks and Shellies. <laughs> Jeez. Ooh. Um, that's my 16th Vorn Clex so far. <clears throat> And we got Thalia in the foil. Three packs left. Fairy Mastermind. Bloated Processor. Processor, sorry. Is sweet. Processor. Infernal Sovereign times two, so that's another Commander Mythic. Dina. Rada. Fairy Mastermind Extended Art Foil. Okay. Grim Grim. Ah, oh, that's cool. Grim Grim. That's sweet artwork. Not one of not gonna retain much value with this printing, but that's okay. Still a pretty cool mythic. I argued that Vorinclax is gonna be a significantly rarer pull. So many people are out there were like, oh god, the monkey's gonna go to zero. There goes my collection. Blah, 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 blah. The monkey's not gonna be an easy pull, folks. Pull the Kronos. Reborn. Of course, he flips. Zephyr Singer. I like this card. Path. Of the Ghost Hunter, so Kaya's Journey. Balduck. Come on, get out of there. Riona. Arona. I don't know why I keep saying that. Kogla and Yadaro. While I don't love the card, that is a cool treatment. Really cool treatment. Obash. Is that it? I think that's it, isn't it? Yep. All right, we're down to the last pack. <clears throat> I'll admit, I don't love what I've gotten here. I, I did enjoy what I got on my first box overall. This one, not as much. I don't even know if it's still a good box or not. I do not know. Galtha and Mavern, pack foil version. Wrinkle and Torbrand. Well, I ain't got one of them yet, so okay. Bitter Thorn, huh? This is Animus. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. This is the this is the living weapon version of a uh, sort of the Animist. That's right. Raph, Shanna, Deep Root Wayfinder. Come on, so let's end. Is it going to be no? Oh, but it is at least a Halo foil version of Hirobi Death's Whale. I was hoping out of my two boxes I'd find one that has a has a number on it, but nope. 
But that is not a terrible way to finish up with a really cool treatment. It looks really good. All right, that's going to be it, folks. That's my second box. All she wrote. Treatments. They knocked the treatments kind of out of the park except for that treatment. What did you guys do there? You just, you just completely phoned it in. I, I get not wanting to make it the same fully. Like, I really do get that. But, like, at least these turned out pretty good. Couldn't at least have done pretty good. No, you didn't even do pretty good. Those, those look stupid. All right. End the video here. I'm going to stop complaining about that border treatment because there are other border treatments that turned out really cool looking. Like this Grim Grim. That's a cool looking... This is a cool looking Grim Grim. Do you disagree? I doubt you do. That's a cool looking Grim Grim. Thanks for watching. New video tomorrow. Like, comment, subscribe. Um, yeah. How are you enjoying this set so far? Are you enjoying it? Are you not enjoying it? Actually, here's the real question. Because I can't imagine it's particularly good. How's the limited environment for this? <laughs> Let me know. Bye.